Hello, this is Douglas Film in the studio on this lovely hot afternoon. Today I'm going to do a little DIY fix it myself type thing and well let me show you what I'm going to fix. Okay, here we have it. I have a Commodore monitor, video monitor model 1702. These things were ubiquitous back in the day of the uh, Commodore 64. My problem is, video was wonderful, but there is no sound. And this thing has a, oh, there's the camera strap, Monario speaker in the top. Okay, let's go in the workshop and see what happens. Okay, here we are in the studio here. Yeah, a little uh, rhododendron in the studio. Here's the setup. There's the Pentax K01. That's going to be the main camera. We've got the Commodore monitor. Vintage. Can you see that? November 1984. And we've got a little LED light. I hate it when people take stuff apart and there's not enough light to see what's inside. And of course, we've got the tools. Two screwdrivers. Looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven, eight screws there. And before I continue on, I would not recommend anybody do this unless they have a little knowledge of what they're doing. You can uh, zap yourself and be caution to prevent electric shock. Do not remove cover. No user serviceable parts inside. Okay, let's uh, get the camera main camera going and continue on. Let's just take out the screws. It's very important when you take out the screws you put them so you know where they are so when you put them back in you have them. Alrighty, let's see if we can get the back of this thing off. Look at that. Hey, look at that! Genuine cobwebs in there. Never touch anything like this with both hands. That down there, that's where your danger can be. Okay, you see that in there? Get the light. I think you can should be able to see that. Put a light on there. See, the uh, CRT was made by Hitachi, it looks like. Okay, now I'm going to do a little uh, ghetto test here. Let's see if the speaker actually works. Let me just connect, disconnect the speaker wires. I got this ghetto set up with an old... Uh, Rechargeable battery. I should get a little static if I connect the battery here. Okay, nothing wrong with the speaker wire. Speaker, so let's put the wires back on and uh, go to the next step. Here okay, we're going to look at the underside of the board here. There we are. Make sure we got her all focused up here. There it is. The back on. Okay, that's pretty much it for today. That was a relatively simple fix. Dirt. Uh, this thing hasn't been going for a couple years and I should have showed you at the beginning where it didn't work with the sound but I guarantee you it didn't work with the sound. So clean it out. Be very careful of the high uh, voltage parts. Don't do this unless you're uh, experienced or have a 
uh, death wish or whatever. Yeah, you have to know what you're doing and what to watch out for. So now I can watch my uh, DHS videos on my uh, Commodore 1702 monitor. Hold on here. Dirt. This is the Avengers, I think, or whatever. This is awesome why I got it, so I can watch these cool uh, VHS movies. So. Okay, that's it for today's video. Stay tuned, and I'll see what I can come up with next. This is Douglas Film here, doing everything in Minix. Bye-bye.